No, I haven't had a girlfriend. So every time you talk about girls, it's funny, isn't it? But it's cap. What is what? What do you mean by it's cap? That's cap. That's that's cap. You confuse me, Logan. <laughs> Feel less of a man, 100, because of how many men and cameras and just production value they have here at at, at, uh, at True Jordy Enterprises. Yeah, are we, we poor? There's a chance. I'm not poor. Oh, that's Tommy. Tommy in it. In it. What's <laughs> up, guys? It's the richest man going. Is that's, that is that a? Right before we started, can I say this? Yeah. You I, ju you just said to me, let's not talk about money too much, and then the well, first thing well, you said. All you have to know about me is I love I do it for the money. Yeah. Well, it's all I do. I right. just love money. Right. I believe you, Tommy. No, no, Thank I, you. I, I, I want to let you know. So, uh, a quick context. Hey, welcome back to Impulsive, number one podcast in the world. Thank you guys for listening, watching, viewing, and subscribing. What's up, Impulsive? It, we're so happy to have Low you, gang. Tommy. Lo, Lo Thank you, dude. Low Gang lives on, by the way. I, Does I, it? Though? I get the. I swear to God, I get the occasional yo, Low Gang for life. Still, I'm in the Low Gang. I bet you probably were. <laughs> no, I still am. I'm the only one. You're leading the pack <laughs> by yourself. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I am the only low gangster going. Yeah, we had a good run, but we're happy to have you on Impulsive, dude. This is next up. Thank you. Um, and yeah, we've been on a we've been on a bit of a bender, Tommy. I'll just I'll be honest with you, bro. You're getting the worst of us. What's a bender? Okay, so this is gonna be good because I'll be your I'll be your older bro, Logan. Right, I aspire to be like you i hope always I hope, I hope you don't no i do i hope not right I, now we, man not right not now. i want to do everything you've ever done i i know you ever had a manic episode before? what's a manic episode yeah mate just don't like do a it. podcast it's it's like a mental <laughs> like where we get all crazy <laughs> it's like a start telling crazy jokes <laughs> which was gonna it's happen yeah. Yeah. yeah am i having a manic episode right now yes yes <laughs> let's let's fucking go boys <laughs> Nah, I'm definitely having a manic episode. Uh, I've been sent into a creative uh, tornado in my brain, and it's been happening for like two weeks. And I've I've been on a bender, which is basically a um, a nonstop drinking, smoking, partying, no sleep, prolonged period of time. It's, ever, it's a bender. You ever met a, a meth head before? It's that's basically me now. You've you've just met one. Oh yeah. With, that sounds the, fun. Without the meth, though, it's well. It, meth is not though. Well, that, as long as you're happy, Logan. I'm, I'm not. <laughs> Let's change that. That's why I'm here. Okay. How are you gonna make me happy? <sighs> Let's talk about Pokemon cards. This what guy, other meaningful things? This guy gets Sharp. it. Yeah. it it's, it's crazy because you're 17 years old, dude. Uh, yeah. But you you function and you talk and even just like how you like a 30 year old man. Yeah, you really yeah. do. Like, what's your, do you have an older brother? Nope. No. I'm an only child. Do you have a, parents? I do have parents. I'm no orphan. Same, same. Yeah. Okay. Um, and and then so how how because you're so you're so you at you, at 17 <laughs> years old. No, bro, you laugh, but I'm I look at you. I'm like, yo, this kid's got like way too much confidence for 17. First thing you did, bro, you came in here. I watched you. We've been here for five minutes. You challenged me, both me and Jordy to a fight <laughs> within five minutes of being here. You looked Jordy in the eyes and you said, I think I could take you. Well, I just know I could. Logan, if you ever want, if you ever need a new boxing partner that isn't Floyd Mayweather, I will crush you, and I will film it, and I will clickbait it. I'm I just saying. Him. I believe. Him. I, I, I told I really you this do. before it's the pod. It's not confidence. It's just facts. I'm gonna tell you again, Tommy. You you are that guy, pal. Uh -huh. What is that guy? Like, before the podcast, Logan kept telling me you're that guy. You you go poggers and pog. I'm like, what what is that guy? I'll so, tell you, I'll tell you, Tom, Tommy. Take your phone out right now. Tweet something. No. Anything. Tweet, tweet, I, tweet. Dude, I don't have Twitter on my phone. What? I can Instagram story. I got rid of it because it's like... What? You what? got You got rid of Twitter? Off my phone. I've got it on my laptop. It's fucking... So you tweet from a laptop? Yeah, I tweet whenever I'm home. That's, that's kind of weird, Tom. Yeah, yeah. You that don't just want Twitter on your that. phone. I feel like that changed the dynamic. Yeah, I don't, you don't want I, Twitter on yeah, your nah, phone. Nah, there's a chance you're not that guy anymore. All of a sudden, I noticed your hair and that comment. It's like... It's poofy. It's voluminous. Well, um, you have great hair. Logan, if you insert. It is. It is good. You know what's funny? What? Uh, uh, every every young influencer, a, a circa fifteen, to, well, no, age like fifteen to twenty one, they start with the poofy hair. You're in poof hair phase. This is like parents' evening, pretty much, dude. So so he was born in the Jurassic period, and I'm I could be your father. Really? How old are you? Twenty eight. That's You're way eleven off. years old. Nah, brother, me. brother. Let me just correct him. That's way off. I'm, I'm That's a, not his age. 
I Why told you. I told you just a few moments ago that he's happy. It's not his age. He's not twenty eight. Twenty eight. No, but he's not. He's twenty six. He's a, he's in the middle of You're a nine a years older than me, dude. You were born in two thousand four. Well done, Logan. Dude, no, no, no. <laughs> that's actually disgu- that's that's disgusting. disgusting. Yo, that's honestly, disgusting. Yo, honestly, the only way to describe dude. that that's offensive. That's, honestly, yo, when you were when you were born, I was I was banging crack rocks behind the Milford Public Library, bro. <laughs> I was already fucking knee deep in prostitutes and God knows what. And you were in 2004. It's actually fucked up, Tommy. Why you would were you knee do that? deep in prostitutes? How? <laughs> Let's talk about that. No, let's not. Let's talk but, about but, that. But how did you end up being so young? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's cool. No. <laughs> how did you end up being so young? So young. Hmm. You know, that's a really interesting take. I just... I have no answer for you. Hmm. You were probably just born in 2004. Oh, yeah, I was, I was just kind of born. Yeah. So listen, Tommy, I do, I do want to... We got to balance genuine and jokes. And sure, I, re- I, really sure. do, I really do want to know, like, how, how, how are you so... Where does this confidence come from? And, and even just the way you speak, you're articulate... You, you know, you're smart, you're intelligent, and you're only 17 years old. And, and, and we didn't give context uh, for people who don't know who you are. Uh, I'm me. You are you. And also, you're crushing it, dude. Thank you. You're crushing it right now. Like, um, he, he mentioned you take out your phone, you do a tweet. Bro, every tweet you do, regardless of whether it's like something uh, value-based or like an emoji, gets Half a million likes. hundreds of thousands of likes and favorites. You, you have 33% engagement on, <coughs> on Instagram, which is fucking unheard of you have three million followers your photos get a million likes bro that's i don't know if there is better engagement on instagram right it's tip, it's typically between five and ten percent you're popping where, do, where does it come from tom you're doing great but why 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 am i doing so great mm-hmm. <laughs> wow logan <laughs> so <laughs> second question here but um why do you think so uh, this is uh, such a tommy i i i'm gonna be honest with you dude i don't follow you on instagram or youtube Don't follow me follow i will after this podcast Thank i wanted you. to get to Thank know you. you first sure and i know you're hilarious that's Thank what i know you. about you but i don't follow your content i like you you know what i'm saying like bro we've been going back and forth in the texts i've been giving you some big bro advice remember what i told you today tommy yeah i was out at the park with my friends and you went go do some rebel shit go ring on doorbells and yep. i went logan that's irresponsible, Logan. And right. you went, nah, nah, dude, nah. You gotta go do it. And I went, it wasn't good advice, Logan. It was. It wasn't good You're advice. You're too buttoned up, Tommy. I'm not buttoned up. You are. I'm dude. buttoned down. You're not. I'm loose. I hate jokes. I like, I like being real. <laughs> <laughs> You're buttoned up, Tommy. I'm not buttoned up. You need to get some. You need some dirt on your hands, dude. You're right. I need to. What was your phrase? Drowning in prostitutes. Prostitutes. Yeah. Knee deep. Knee deep. Knee deep. Knee deep. Was can you do? Can you do a beard? Have you ever tried a beard? Yeah, I have to shave in the morning. I don't want a beard. You are lying. Give me a couple years. I'll I'll do something terrible. Then I'll grow a beard, and then I want to go. I get that guy. I get him now. He's no, an no, the I beard. Can, can the beard is like what that. gets you out of the terrible. Really? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, you get the beard after, or get a cat. You can do that. That's how I get out. I'm saving it. I'm saving it for when I do something. Tommy, I told you also today, which is what I thought you were gonna say, that the fastest dollar earned is the dollar saved. You know, yeah, and you just responded with something like poggers or something. <laughs> well, why are you, te- why are you I was, telling? I was this? on the train trying to think of Minecraft ideas, and you're like, "Dude, I'm gonna change your life." I'm like, "Logan, I don't need life changing right now. I need some water." I, I was thirsty <laughs> at the time, bro. He he is he, so so. Before we came on the show today, <sighs> we were like, "We're gonna throw smoke bombs to try to just like I stole your water, unsettle me." Fuck you, man. Smoke bomb me. Would you do that? I, I, I said we we're gonna we we're gonna throw smoke bombs and try to like run the dynamic you're running the dynamic thank you you're controlling this this is this is your show this is you know this is my podcast and i what questions do i have for you why why do you go out partying why do you why don't you sit at home and you know went from impulsive to intervention really well i just you know i just want to know you you know you're very interesting fellas it isn't a lifestyle i'm very familiar with i uh, you know i have quite a lack of perspective on things so why Mm. when i get 20 shall i go out and do hard crack like (laughs) is it good is it worthwhile (laughs) will i regret it in my late 40s logan i want to know you yes you will you will (laughs) i don't do crack why i just don't but what if i I really don't do crack i won't do i've never done it i never will i swear to god i'll be honest with you I'll be, be honest, honest with, with me. That's all I've ever wanted. I, I will. I, I've never done crack, cocaine. 
Okay. I never will. I just, I, the method of ingestion, any, anything right to the brain scares me. I, I feel like you have no idea what I'm talking about. This is why well, I'm saying you got to get dirty, bro. But not, not drugs. I'm saying like, Tommy, go have some fun. When's the last time you had fun? Some real fun. Wow. You go to the park with your boys, throw a disc or something? You ever bought an NFT? Why would I buy an NFT? A lot of people doing it. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking weird, man. No, investing, you got to be safe. S&P 500, man. Investing's pretty like, you don't want to do NFTs and crypto. Are yeah, you yes, you do. Are you in stocks? Not yet, but I'm, I don't know. It's, it doesn't interest me very much. I just want to go out and fucking... You, and do what, though? And go out and what? I don't know. Go out and speak to girls, Logan, and, you do, talk and do alcohol. Is that, I'm going to underage drink, and then I'm going to film it you and told post me, it on TikTok. You told me that you drink tequila. <laughs> well, that's all I do. I'm a raging alcoholic, Logan. You should know this about me. <laughs> Why is everyone... Stop laughing. You're funny, dude. You Thank should. You, you, should you should potentially uh, consider a career in comedy. Oh, I'm, I really like... Logan, you are known... You're in a Bo Burnham song, Logan. That's how I know you. No, it's not. You're in that funny... Fe- Logan, you're part of the funny feeling. I know. <laughs> how do you feel about it? How was that? I feel like I'm a very easy butt of a joke. I feel you like often my, my name... I'm a butt for sure. My name is just like thrown out there as like the butt of a joke. Like, bro, you, are you fucking upset Jim- with Bo? I'm, I'm upset with Jimmy Kimmel, dude. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Bo, Why? Bo, I get it. I'm upset with Jimmy Kimmel for real. You know who Why? that is? Yeah, yeah, James, isn't it? The talk show host. Big yeah. Kimmel. Yeah, James, James K. J- JK. JK, as we J- call yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. yeah, good old Jimmy. Yeah. Uh, Do you know him? Yeah, yeah. So I, I went on a show. I was, he, he was uh, fortunate enough. He invited me on, um, you know, his late night show. I, I opened up to him, dude. I, I, I talked about me missing my testicle. Like, it was, it was some serious conversation. Oh. Yeah, and and, yeah, and I'm and, just too young. I didn't. No, nah, it's fine. Cool. Sorry. You can watch yeah. it on YouTube. Okay, I will. I will. You have YouTube? Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I dabble on your phone or just m- I have it desktop. On my phone. No, I have it on my phone. Cool. So, <laughs> cool. No, so no, bro. He went. On, he went on a show recently, and he and he made a joke. He said. So, he said. He he said me and Donald Trump are the worst people on earth. You fucking asshole, Jimmy it. Kimmel. Honestly, Jimmy, fuck you, bro. I'm not. No, fuck that. How are you about to invite me on a show and have like a cordial? friendly familial relationship and then a year and a half later wh- when by the way i'm doing well i'm i'm well, I tr- i'm doing well i'm dude. not with this guy jimmy just for you can invite me on <laughs> fuck you jimmy Kimmel. <laughs> fuck you like what why now it's just they, they it's like they look at it as like a, a quick easy dub but go, go after one of the Paul brothers. That, that is that is the lamest shit to me. That uh, is so uh, fucking lame. Your writers were so th- so uh, uh, lacking content and creativity. They had to do some lame ass Paul joke. The Tonight shows have never been uh, have never equaled comedic genius. They're here for the easy wins. The Paul brothers. The Paul brothers. Logan and Jake Paul. You a Jake Paul fan? Are you Jake Paul? I'm a Logan Paul fan. You know I'm a low ganger. I, I tell you what, last year I, w- I was into your vlogs when you were posting them a bit. And I said on stream and everyone was like, stop! And so I, I did stop for a little bit. And then I got back into them, but secretly this time. Nice. But I've not watched Jake. We were, we were killing it last year with the vlogs, I gotta say. Like, oh. I, I, that was the only like, year. That's very of, modest of you, Logan. No, I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. You gotta, be honest with me. You gotta know when you make good shit. Let me write that down. That was a, that was a good... Oh. Uh, that's, bro, you gotta acknowledge when you have a win. You got to know when you write good shit. Thank you, Logan. I'll get that tattooed you, on me. I will. You're welcome, Tommy. He's smoking you. I know. I, I, he's, honestly, he's fucking me up. Seeing time. his performance here today, I think he might be able to beat you in a fight. I think so, I too. reckon I could. I'd, I'd just make you cry. You're the same height, height as me. <laughs> yeah, I know. I could have you. Six foot three. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. Nope. You yeah, also told me outside you round up. No. <laughs> no. You're not even Why six Why would two. I round? I'm six three. No, you want to get girls. We've, it's all you talk about. We've seen your YouTube. And we've seen Logan, one I'll YouTube fight video. You. you know I will. I know you won't. You know I will. I know. I'll cry and then you'll get hate. Oh my God. He's Let me ask smart. you something. Let me ask he's you so something. Right. Tommy, Tommy. He's so this right. is a genuine question, bro. Sure. <clears throat> How much of you like like taunts, um, like people like Jordy, me, Mike, you know, you challenge every adult male in this room to a fight. <laughs> How much? Of, how much of that is you knowing that you're 17 and I I won't, Catch you know, lunge case. across the table and slap the shit out of you? Because you wouldn't if I, I was. Because it's funny. <laughs> it's not, you know. No, I would. Ne- I would never. I'm saying, but like, definitely, you have some room to play. Like, bro, no, no adult is gonna assault you. Oh yeah. But as soon as you turn 18, you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna get assaulted. I risk it a little bit. I don't know if that's, that's true. why I've got big Russ. I, I think he's. Just, I think he's. 
It's not an age thing with him, man. It's not. It's it's the hair. It's he has no facial. It, like, Mike, dude, you. if you if you <laughs> Mike, if you put your hands on this, kid, me. What, don't put your hands on me, Mike. Look, look, he he looks like a, a saint. He looks like a saint, dude. Like, would you ever consider hitting this man? I would, boy. I would never. I would never, Tom. No, Logan. If you tried to attack me, I would film a TikTok of it. Yeah, and you, and you would be gone like that. Gone. The low gang. The, your only low gang member would be gone. <laughs> and that's. And you know, to that. I don't want it. I don't want that. You don't. I need you. You need me, Logan. I didn't even. I didn't even consider that. Can we? Uh, that's can we why just, I'm here. Can we reset and just dive a little bit into <laughs> Tommy in it? Once again, you tried to provide some context, but this dude is just throwing the bombs. It's like Tommy, what do you do? I'll tell you, Logan, what I don't do. Fuck with you, mate. Like, <laughs> bro, let's talk about what you do. Sure. What sure. did you? You got it. You 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 play Minecraft. You got a great YouTube channel. Thanks, man. Yeah. What What do you do? What is Tommy and its brand? So I've got I've got three main things at the moment. I got Tommy in it, which is my sort of gaming channel where I just do all my bits. It's mainly for like jokes and shit. Um, it's like I do IRL videos as well as Minecraft. That's my main one. Uh, I've got Tom Simons, which has only been going on for a couple of months. I mean, we're recording for that tomorrow. Um, that's my more vlog channel where I'm trying to like I'm trying to hit to new audiences on that. I want that to keep going bigger and bigger. Uh, and then recently. By accident, I've got TikTok, which has like 10 million on, and I've just been doing jokes on it, and all of a sudden it keeps blowing up, and it's confusing, but that's all what I do. No, 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 no. This is, this is, it's fascinating, because like, you do have a very like Vine-esque, like, sh like, like nice little zinger comedy type style. Of course, you start on Vine, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But it, it, it works well for TikTok, so it actually doesn't surprise me that you're able to do a bunch of different platforms you, yeah. really well. Like, like. Like I'm, I'm not kidding. When I look at you, I kind of, I kind of feel like, I kind of feel like you're a young PewDiePie almost, but funnier. I think I'm a younger you, Logan. I, I so again, I, 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 I don't say that. I am. You, you have so much I more am. potential. I just want to be like you, Logan. You gotta stop. Tommy. I just want to be like you. <laughs> Everyone agrees. Everyone does. Leave a like. How many views did you get in your first vlog, YouTube vlog, Logan? Twelve thousand. Yeah, that's facts. How many? I, I saw you post your first YouTube vlog. First vlog. Vlog. How many views did you get on it? 30 bill was my first one. That was also my most viewed video. It was pretty like, you know, it's coincidental. <laughs> Thanks guys for watching. What can I say, guys? I love numbers. <laughs> like, I'm really cool. Cool. Your first video? That's like, insane. What? Okay. First vlog though. Like yeah, I'd already you, had like a million subs at that point. What is it? What is it about? Tommy? Yeah, what is it? Tommy? What's, what's your thing? Like what's your, why is What's my secret? What's my secret Give spice? us the sauce. No. <laughs> Fair enough. I, no, I, I don't really. Uh, I, 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 I feel like I try to make my stuff pretty real, like that. I mean, that's sort of what we're like off camera, and it's just us making jokes. Like it's not like we are surrounded by prostitutes doing this. That it's like I just want it to be what we want to do. Like I have one vlog we did recently, which was I just went to Bogner and Brighton and hung out with my mates, and I just sort of clipped it together over the week, and then that got like eight million views, and it was I just called it a week in my life. And I think it's just I think it's the like. I'm not trying to bullshit anyone, you know? I think that's sort of my main thing. It's number one. I believe YouTube will once again reach a, a place of authenticity. I think yeah. people are going to be fiending for that. Because right, right now, content's in a weird... It sucks. It kind of sucks, dude. Do you want me... I like... The, the problem with YouTube at the moment... Like, and it's not a problem, right? But it's all... It's, especially with the rise of TikTok and... Sorry, I'm not rambling, am I? I just... I go for it. Tommy, this it's is a show. podcast. And it's your, I always your ask. Your I literally I'm, talk I'm as new, much as you I'm want. I'm new. Um, no, like I feel like it's a video game, right? Like no, no matter what the subject, whether you're talking about some uh, like human rights issue, you'll have dubstep over it to increase retention. It's about the lighting in the first frame to make it like that. And it's not, it's about the metrics being higher. It's not about the, the, the art and the content being better. And I think especially with the rise of TikTok being like, dude, let's make it as fast paced and have subtitles everywhere as possible. Like, I don't know. I, I, I think with my stuff at the moment, I'm trying to lean towards like, the sort of an element of that. So it performs good and stuff, but I don't want it to be this shit where it's like, here's the retention. Here's how fast paced it is. Here's how, like, it's got to be good and, and funny. And I think my thing at the moment is I'm focusing much more like over the, is it retention? Is the thumbnail good? Is that like, it's got to be funny first and like a, like a good thing and then start thinking about the YouTube stuff. Like that comes first. Good. I think that's why YouTube at the moment, like it's all just weirdly paced and, and it's like a meta and everyone like, and it's cool and it's fine. But when that goes on for a year, everyone stops trying to make sort of art, you know? Mm -hmm. and, I, and I think it's about making that is why, and it's why it's kind of lame at the moment. Not all of it, but just, you know, elements. A, a very high level take 
on on something and i, I actually 100 percent agree with you like you're you're definitely wise beyond your years bro um Thank you. and, and and it is a shame that the statistics now kind of rule literally like how successful you'll be on youtube and so like you said people are just focusing on retention um but even even like we watched a couple of your videos on the way here and you do this you just you subtitle yeah you, all yeah. of your videos so so I, so I think the thing is you can sort of view youtube differently right and i think like mr beast i know he views it as a ceo and he has hundreds of employees and he wants to you know be a billionaire and that, that's cool like for me i sort of view youtube as a platform and a bit of a video game like to me the stats is like it doesn't really make any sense because i'm a fucking 17 year old I don't, I don't really get what any of this money or youtube or numbers mean because mm. it's just like why would i man mm. um but to me it's sort of like a video game that element of it and just like making and for the subtitles like i started doing that because i thought they were colorful and made the videos look nicer <laughs> and like a cooler and like for me I, I make only really comedy videos and it makes jokes land more because when my mate rambu says something quietly you can get it in oh, okay. subtitles. like i just think that makes it for sure, like funnier. for sure. And, and I'm sure it helps with retention as well, right? Yeah, that's, yeah. And that's like, I'm not denying that that's what I do. I'm not, you know, yeah. that, that wasn't me implying. I think it's just like remembering that when people are making YouTube videos at the moment, it's more of a game than it is an art form, yes. which is fine. Yes, completely, like, completely yes. well yeah. said. But in, like in one if, sentence, that's If Bo like, Burnham posted Inside on YouTube, it would not have blown up like it did on Netflix because it's you know, that, that's art and it's not retention based. And he would have had to make the first minute way faster to include all the younger viewers. And it's like, it would, it, all that would have mattered is that the thumbnail was good. It's like, that's not what art is, you know? Yeah, yeah, agree. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. Have you been making videos your whole life? Like, I, again, you're so young and I'm assuming you didn't get good all of a sudden. You probably no, been doing so this for, I, a lot, um, for a while. Yeah, yeah, I've done it for about three years. Um, I did streaming for about a year, which was just sort of learning about how to talk to audiences, comedic timing, yep. joking. Yep. Uh, and then I started doing videos. And I probably spent about six months just sort of understanding Premiere. Um, I did like YouTube a couple of years before that, but I like, got rid of it because my school found my channel and stuff. You you edit <laughs> your videos? Uh, yeah, no. a lot of them now. Not all of them. I, I have editors now, but I like, I'm very... Hands on. Yeah, I, I like, but like every video I sit and review and like make out like eight points of like like a load of things I want it to be different. And a lot of the time they just send me the Premiere profile and I just do it myself. No way. I was gonna ask you about this because there's a there's an intricacy to your videos that um, you know most most creators like to view their final product before it goes out. And um, one of them there was it looked like it had been storyboarded almost. I think you were talking about girls. We are always talking about girls. <laughs> Lady Killer. I'm trying to do more than that though. At the moment, I, I saw a comment that was like, "It's kind of, it's kind of his main bit at the moment." So I'm trying to keep doing. It's a good bit. It's a Thank good you, bit. But for you know, you, you, you can do that bit as well as loads of other shit. You know, yeah, so yeah, I'm trying yeah. to do. Yeah. You you are you uh lazy. you went on a date the other day or something? Yeah, my, yeah, yeah. That was that was cool. It was good. Are yeah, you, yeah. So I you're it. you're dating? No, it, it, the Minecraft date. Yeah, the Minecraft date. But I also heard you mentioned you went on a real life date and like some some of your fans like came up and ruined the date. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, I'm, I mainly wanted to phrase that so it sounded fucking exciting as shit. I was mainly just out with my mate and like... Oh. So you weren't even on a date? I mean, was, I mean, you know me, Logan. I'm, I'm, I'm always surrounded I by actually, women. I actually don't know you. You know me, Logan. <laughs> I don't. You know me. I, we just No, met. you just know me. I just, I just get you. We just click. <laughs> leave a like. <laughs> me? <laughs> yes. I'll, I'll leave a like on the video. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, of That's course. No, but only three years, Tommy. That's insane. That's like that. The the learning curve is. Cr Do you think there's a chance that Tommy's learning curve to become as big as he is is because he's fucking Gen Z and he gets like tech and and these like what do you mean social media curve? platforms? Who's, who? Bro, it took me t it took me ten years before I like got good at YouTube. It ta it takes most people five to ten years before they become decent at their craft, right? Just, Otherwise, ever everyone would do it. Yeah. Well, I mean, I, I grew up with it, and then, like, in the quarantine, like, before, I had, like, 100,000 subscribers, but I didn't, I didn't really get YouTube. Before but, the quarantine? Yeah, yeah, the start of quarantine of last year. I oh, so you day. just blew up. Yeah, I had 4 million at the start of this year. What are you at now? 10. <sighs> well, it's, it's August? September? What is, what is, <clears throat> what is causing, like, this explosive like who are these people who are your fans like what is their general persona what is their age give me the demographic like tell me some data uh you stole them out like te like teenagers that watch i, I don't really know but do they <laughs> i mainly get recognized by people like my age 
when I'm out. So, mm -hmm. sort of. but are they Minecrafters? Are they like you, dirty dogs? Do they want to beat up low? Like, who are these people? You know what I'm saying? Like, what are their interests? What are their hobbies? Yeah, I mean, I think I, I, I think for my stuff, it's mainly like people who have the same sense of humor as me, which I usually find is sort of people my age, bit bit lower, bit above. Like, I don't think there's Especially with the more vlog stuff, I think like like my mum watches it and tells me what she thinks of them. You know, mm, mm. you think it's uh, primarily UK? Uh, no, it's like sixty percent American. And no like way, UK. I think it's funny. A lot of a uh, a lot of UK YouTubers, I feel like, have um, UK based comedy. Yeah, and, and, and do I and, have that? No. Really? No, yeah. I think your I think your stuff's definitely more broad, which would explain. I'm not very good at like analyzing my own jokes, like so I, I couldn't really tell you. You always been funny. <clears throat> uh, I've been into doing jokes. I've always been talking, like just talking. Yeah, I just like talking. I, I yeah. But I'd say over the past couple of years is when I've really tried to do. Like, I want to sort of, I look up to Bo Burnham a lot and stuff like that because I mm. kind of want to try, not even as like my main thing, but I want to try stand up and other types of comedy because I just think it's fucking. You well you you you, ha you have to, bro. I'm not gonna lie, you really you really should. You're Thank you're you. like you're like way too funny to not exercise that muscle. It's Thank it's you. it's it's what I um like pretty much made George get into mm -hmm. every day for like four months straight. Every single fucking day I text him, reminder to get into stand-up comedy and finally he did it and he's amazing at it, you know? So uh, George? Yeah, jo George, he, he, uh, he sat here yeah, for the last time. And by the way... <sighs> well, are we going to have that breakdown like where we're talking about other shit? Yeah, I guess, yeah. So let's, let's do it. Long story short, he's usually on the show but this was a bit of a, a send for a podcast to come all the way over here. He didn't want to... It seemed like a also we didn't a lot of distance. Well, we didn't come here for the podcast. I came here for other shit, and then you happened to be also Shoot coming content, to, yeah. to or be willing to come to Europe, and yeah. here we are, Tommy. So so okay. What so can I say? listen, are you dating or not, dude? Are no. you no? No, I haven't had a girlfriend. So every time you talk about girls, it's funny, isn't it? But it's cap. What is what? What do you mean by it's cap? That's cap. That's that's cap. You confuse me, Logan. <laughs> I think, I think I'm too smart for you. I think so. Yeah, I, I think, just think I am. I think that's possible. <laughs> you're a smart kid. Yeah, the best. But, but you, but you don't, bro. You're 17 years old. You make, you make, you make millions of dollars. You don't billions. go billions. You don't billions of dollars. You yeah. don't go to NFT. school. You make NFTs. You don't go to school. I go to school. Actually, yeah. Tomorrow like, for our shoot, I've had to like sign in at college and be like, really sorry, can't can't go in that day. college university. No, college here is like the like high school. High school. 16 to 18. Yeah, home, I'm in, I'm in three days a week. Homeschooled or public school? Public school. I'm in three days a week. I was up at seven for the past two days. Wait, you still... You, you, you go still to public go, school? You still go now? Yeah. What happens? What's that like? What, is, what, what is it like with YouTube or just like... Yeah, fun, just like, does everybody like... How do you get treated? Well, I, I don't know. Everyone's pretty... If people... Are, I just go... I just, I'm just a guy that makes videos. You know, who, who cares? Yo, nah, nah, cool. bro. You're famous as fuck. You're like UK, one of UK's... No, no, yeah, you are... Wanky. You get recognized down the street. That doesn't mean I'm just a guy. Like all of the, when I'm in the pub, all the 40 year olds, none of them give a shit about me. I'm just, I'm just I just make videos. Not, like, not, not, pretty cool. not I'm quite. A, I'm a 40 year old. I give a shit about you. Oh, well, Mike. Thank you, Mike. <laughs> you know, you never, you never stop to flatter me. I, oh. No, it is. It is tough, bro. I'm noticing myself not saying certain things because you're underage. Yeah, the side men won't have me in any of their videos because I'm fucking... Really? I'm, yeah, well, it makes sense, though, because you watch it and it's all, like, dick-sized jokes. I'm like, you wouldn't want to make that with a 17-year-old. When, when are you going to be 18 so you can start making dick-sized jokes? It's all I want to do is make dick-sized jokes. I know, so I can tell. I can feel that energy Thank coming you. from you. What, when's, <laughs> you're in Aries? When's your birthday? Oh, dude, star signs are bullshit. Yeah, what? listen, what? I agree, bro, but, like, <laughs> if you, if you want to get girls, you got to know about these a little bit. You have to know what sign you are. Uh, Cause, How cause do I get girls? You'll like never me. meet a girl, not one, ever, who doesn't know her astrology <laughs> to the fucking T. You're going to hear, I'm an Aries, but I'm a rising Capricorn. And my lead... Sounds a little My Sagittarius is... Logan. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm, yes, it I'm is. into that. I, it is, I'm stereotyping, yes. I love it yeah. when my girls know they horoscope. You don't have girls. We just... It's cap. No, I do. So now you I, do. I never cap. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good. Why do I feel like you would make a good magician? <laughs> could you see him? Could you see him doing magic tricks? Are you high? I'm permanently. High. <laughs> I'm never coming down. No, that's cool. What's a What's the craziest thing you've done as a 17 year old? 
Uh, we did the skydiving. That was pretty exciting. I'm talking the, about some some real shit, Tommy. Like um, like really get really get into okay. it, dude. Getting, getting recognized. Like we we got mobbed at a train station. That was fucking like crazy. It's like yeah. a once in a lifetime experience. Never drove a car in reverse at, at 50 miles an hour down a residential street. Nope. Okay. Drove a car though. Stalled it once. That was bad. Cool. Yeah. Do you hardwire it? Nope, just, you know, stalled it. And then, you, then my driving instructor went, don't do that. How, went, how, do you right. feel, how do you feel about your ability to, like, construct things, like, build? Like, say you got a, a, a piece of furniture from Ikea. Could you assemble it? With my dad's help? It's not, you know. I've got people like you, Logan, to do that for me. Because I am a billionaire. That's true. You don't need to deal with, like, that I don't. peasant shit. I, I hate <laughs> things that are puny. Time is money, Logan, and money is time. Or... You, I just love money and I hate jokes. Yeah. So how much money have you made total? <sighs> Billions. Billions, right? Billions. I just love NFT. No, you don't. <laughs> yeah, I do. What I take percentage an image of, of what... face and I sell it. Makes no sense, but I make billions. I wish I could just not take anything seriously but and be at that age. It's what, so what, fun. What percentage of you um, uh, is serious? about anything you, that you say <laughs> is there any like bro stop. like i'm honestly so jealous of that like can i ask you a question sure has anything has anything like bad ever happened to you <laughs> like, is that, like, like this tommy because if not it's, it's gonna, about to it's about gonna right fight. fucking hell no you ever no, been through hardship yeah, you ever been trauma. through traumas <laughs> I, I, you know, I never thought I'd, I'd be sat on a table with a little, and you go, have you ever been through trauma, Tommy? You know, this is such a weird, uh, very surreal well, I moment. Just, I just, your, your, your attitude and your demeanor towards life is just so, uh, like, like. Optimistic, incredible, in, brilliant. Uh, all of those things. Thank and you, and, and, and oh, just You said so, it yourself. And so relaxed and just like jovial. Is that the word? Yes, is that the right? It's a word. No, but I mean, is that the best term to describe his demeanor? Jovial. I am jovial. I can't tell if it's real or not. It's all real. Jokes, they're cringe. Take the mask off, Tommy. Yeah, take your mask okay. off, Tommy. What's really, we want, what's really we want, going we want on? Tommy, uh, yeah, yeah, sure. I'll get, I like to, uh, on podcast, I'm, I like switching very fast between genuine and doing jokes. That's sort of my, my shit. But I can get, you know. Same, so what's, what's your real last name, dude? Simons. We want Tommy Simons here. Tommy Simons. With us That's today. what they call me. Yeah. Um, yeah, I found the start of this year pretty hard with anxiety and stuff about mm. going out in public. The whole getting recognized shit, uh, that was really overwhelming. I, I think a lot of it, uh, the sort of feeling of alienation with YouTube and people not seeing you for just like a guy that makes videos. And it's totally easy to solve. And I feel like, you know, like I, I'm, I'm a lot happier with it and better with it now. But that, I mean, that was a struggle at the start of this year. It's an interesting... Um, What's your experience with that, with anxiety on YouTube? Uh, no, no anxiety I, I, for me... Um... If you mind me asking, sorry. No, I know, no, I don't. I, confrontational. No, no, I don't mind. Yeah, no, no anxiety for me. I mean, you know, there's, there's, there's hardships that come with YouTube. Um, but being recognized, Tommy, is, is, you know, it's what you sign up for. Like whether or not you like it, it's like it's part of the game. But I think it wasn't what I signed up for. Was sort of the point. I didn't realize, and I'm like, oh, no, shit. N that's silly. Yeah, that's but I didn't. Silly. I didn't know I was gonna have ten million. Ha I thought I was gonna have thirty thousand and get high pixel YouTube rank and go fuck yeah, and it's all be done. <laughs> so, like so let me ask you something. You have 30,000 subscribers. Yep. You're 35 years old. You just you just continue to just make YouTube videos with 30,000 subscribers forever? That can't work. I think I would have tried to be a I, just, I, I didn't know I was ever going to have 10 million. You know, like it's such a weird... I didn't know I'd be sat here with Logan Paul going, what's your trauma, Tommy? <laughs> that's not... I, I wouldn't have predicted this a couple of years Welcome ago. Welcome so to an open conversation with adults, Tommy. That's yeah, what, that's what As an adult about. myself, I love to join in with this. I'm, I'm, here, I'm here... Bro, you can be vulnerable with us. Thank it's a safe space, me. Tommy. Minus, I mean, actually... Minus the, you know, millions my, of viewers. Minus the cameras. Cool, yeah. Well, people people like when 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 one, oh, anyone, opens up on our, on our podcast. Sure, no, I'm happy to open up. Um, you know. No, but no, but I, I, I feel you, so... Uh, anxiety or any other uh, uh, YouTube related kind of breakdowns or, or feelings? I, I wouldn't say I've ever had like a like a breakdown or thing. I think it, the, the overwhelm, because again, I didn't predict this and it all went from 100K to millions really fast. Instantly, yeah. I, I'd say the big thing I always end up talking about is getting recognized because it's such this weird phenomenon that you're not meant to experience. Uh, like, like I'm one in very few people that have, you know, been mobbed at a train station and, that, and that's weird. Um, I think alienation was a pretty big thing. I got I got pretty upset at the start of this year just about the idea of 
you know, like, I just want to be, I, I want to go out to the park and just hang out with my mates and not worry about, you know, being at college and someone coming up to me because of that. And I think that, like, for me, my outlook was, because I, I was thinking about dropping out of college. Like, I was really anxious about it. I didn't like the idea of going out in public. I, I didn't like that it was this choice between privacy and identity. You know, if I want to wear my red and white top, which is my favorite top, or, or like this, because I posted on Instagram, it, oh, I got toothpaste on, that because I posted on Instagram, everyone's gonna, like, people come up to me. That was, like, I went out with, like, with glasses and a disguise, because I was like, fuck, I want to see, and I still was getting recognized. Yeah. But I think I was in the call with my mate Will, uh, Wilbur, I don't know if you know, you yep. can meet yep. him tomorrow. Yep. And, I, and I was saying to him, like, dude, I'm, I'm thinking about it. And he was like, fuck off. You're just a guy that makes videos. You don't have any A-levels. And although you get recognized, it's cool. Like, when you're in the pub, no one knows who you are. And even, like, it's cool. Like, don't drop out of college. Go when, are, when are you in yeah, the pub? Yeah, when you're at the pub. Oh, all the time. And fire. <laughs> you're not just That's a guy crazy. that makes videos, though, you know? Yeah, I am. It's not. It's you're not, like, dude. You're, like, a very, like, special kid with a, a thing that you're very good at, and a lot of people like it. Yeah, but that doesn't mean... It does. Anything. Unfortunately, again, it's what it's what you signed up for. And I know getting recognized is weird, bro. But let me tell you something. It is much weirder for the people recognizing you, which is why it's yeah. it's weird for both. Dude, when you see someone who like these people watch you religiously, they think they know you. Right. Are they, I mean, they do. It's they, and, and by the way, they, with you, they probably do. Because with yeah. you, what you see is what you get pretty much. Sure. You know, but it, it's like now you, you got to look at it down like, like being able to go, go out and share the like because a lot of the time now when I get recognized, it's sort of people who just know my face, which is fine. But we're like now and then when you share a really impactful moment with someone and they're like, holy shit, like, thank you. That, that's incredible. And being able to experience that is 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 brilliant. And I wouldn't you know, that's worth feeling a bit shitty when you're trying to go out and speak to people and you, you're getting recognized. For life. sure. But no, I, dude, I'm just a guy that makes videos. I'm not really different to anyone watching this other than I spend more time looking at my YouTube studio and thinking about thumbnails because that's just my job you know like say like when my mates who i'm hanging out with have to leave early to go to the chip shop that's just their job it's not like who gives a shit i i, I hear you and i love your hum humility it's 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 awesome and you should always stay like that but like bro steven spielberg's just a guy who makes movies right yeah but i like Elon musk is just a guy who launches his rockets into space i yeah. like that attitude though no it's I fantastic think if you, I it's think fantastic if you can go through not, i think if yeah. you can go through the majority of the journey without taking it too seriously and, and keeping it as i'm just a guy who makes videos and like it's i think that i think that humble approach is inter is is has longevity to it you know I think what i'm saying the, the way it's I've, good it's good the way i've thought about it is like i used to in like year nine sit and watch all the sidemen's diss tracks with my friends and you always view it as like holy shit that's ksi and fixed star mini but like so much so many leagues above me and then you go and like and now i have like the same amount of subscribers ksi had when he was doing his diss tracks and you're like oh no i mean they were just guys making videos yeah, talking, like, yeah. It's, it's fun they're still you know they're still going home and unpacking the dishwasher and being guys and you know like who gives it you're just a dude that makes it and like i don't know that's it to me that's why i don't that's why i'm pretty like turned off about money stuff as well like it's just not really something i it impacts me or thinks about. I just sort of hang out with my mates and stuff. Keep yeah. interesting. Keep that. Yeah, it's, 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 it's I, I just make videos, you know, and tell jokes to a camera. It's like, it, it's fantastic. Thank you. I want to see how that chips away. It, it'll be interesting to see how that chips away. You know what it I'm always, saying? It's it like what, 21, what and it's like, oh, the Rolls Royce now. Nah, like, like, let's see what happens. Yeah, man, with fuck it. that. I, I don't want any of that rich shit. Like, it's, it's arsehole-y and I, and like, Cap. I. I wouldn't. I don't know what that means. Do you have like a Do you have like a dream car? Do you have like a dream? Any? Do no. you ever have dreams? Not that are like like that. I want to make videos and do cooler things, and you know, like I've got loads of dreams when it comes to YouTube and like making more, I guess, art and stuff like that. But fucking, who cares about a golden like? You know, I don't, I don't give a shit about that. He's on his hustle. I want to I wanna learn about with. psychology yeah. and stuff. I want to learn about. I want to learn about psychology and comedy and writing i really want to learn about writing techniques like those are my dreams and like study that my dream isn't let's get a lamborghini and be <laughs> around sure. prostitutes like for no, sure who cares <laughs> the prostitutes again i don't think i don't think anyone who's <laughs> who's ultra successful led with the, uh, the their goal to be getting a lamborghini but like eventually it's you know you look around you look at your bank account you're like i have some extra money there's a nice thing i kind of want it splurge you know you, you're right i've got on like the bigger fish and chips so i didn't need to get it like, i feel you but that's was it filling it was too much i and then i didn't do it again because i knew it was too much yeah. like, it's not i don't i don't know money, money doesn't lose its value just when it suddenly gets all strange you just have to go oh cool now i can like I'm, I'm just very very lucky and grateful that it's not something i have to spend hours worrying about you know and mm. it's like it, but it doesn't change anything it's just like you like you know you can get all this wanky ass shit but it's still I don't, and, I, and there's nothing wrong with that as well if you want a golden lamborghini and that's something that boosts your self-esteem and makes you happier that's fine it just 
doesn't for me. Like, mm. like I would totally get some crazy lighting system that would improve my content, but, oh, sorry. but like, that's just not, I, I'm not asked about it personally. I, 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 I uh, that's, that's super cool. I often uh, have this feeling when I watch Aiden's uh, live streams, like Aiden, Aiden is making a lot of money. Who's Aiden, sorry? Aiden Ross. Uh, oh yeah, sure. Yeah. yeah. He, yeah. He, bro, the kid makes bank and yeah, he's still laptop webcam. Green, on the laptop. Yeah, because it's about... Curtains in his in room. Background. Curtains, like, I, it looks like he hung a towel up over the window. You know, he keeps, he keeps it humble, which I think your audience definitely appreciates. Yeah, like, I got an office recently. I was a bit like, I'm, I'm, I'm not... I haven't been streaming until I decorate it, because I'm like, I just don't really like that I'm in it. I, mm. I preferred being in my room. But, I like, I felt like I had to get out of there, because it was the work-life separation as yeah. well. Yeah. It's quite important to me. I think, I, think, I think until about, like... 22 23 all the money you make should probably go right back into your content you know um I because mean, sort of, but i'm again like i watch all the sidemen and mr beast videos like giving a homeless man 10 million dollars and then yeah. it pounds to him going subscribe to mr beast it's like i don't give a shit about it i want to sit and play minecraft with my mates at 3 a.m and record that and tell jokes like mm. like the thing we're doing tomorrow is we when, wait when does this podcast come out next week okay cool yeah. like yeah like the thing we're doing is just Going around London and telling up me, you, and Wilbur. Like, Making dumb funny. jokes. Yeah, we don't. It doesn't have to be this fucking. We are the billionaires with. Bro I keep saying, sorry about it. But yeah, it's like. <laughs> well, because well, because okay, we 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 came to this conclusion as well. Like, um, because you're funny. You know, you're entertaining. Like, you, you. anyone's in a room with you. You know, they're listening to your jokes. Uh, you know, not everyone's like that. They got They got to have a, a, a twang to their video or a theme. Um, and because. Oh, anyone here could just sit here, watch you, talk to you all day, and be entertained. Thank you. Um, but ah, just pull it. You, ah, sorry. Take your time. You're man. good. Sorry, take your, Logan. Take your time, Tommy. Oh, thank you. Thank you. So, all right. But I think also Gen genuine yeah, yeah. question. This is not. I'm not. I'm not trying to prompt you or lead you into something. But sure. do, do you think it's a bit odd that you're 17 years old sitting on millions of dollars? Billions, for the record. Billions and. Yeah, it's fucking weird as shit, and I never, I never would have predicted this, but it's like, I am so lucky, and it, like this is a thing that I would have dreamed about three years ago. Even dude, I used to watch your videos. My, my, even like my friend Wilby, he was one of my favorite YouTubers. So yeah, this is this is the dream. This is absolutely cool. So I would never want to spend a, a a moment like, I, I don't know. I, I think I, I it was very important to me what I was doing before, and I think that's. Fucking! I don't want to do anything different. I want to do that better, you know, and learn more about comedy. Like this is, I, I'm just so grateful for it. It's sick, man. It's, it, it it sounds like he's been media trained. I'm not even fucking with you, bro. Who, who, we got we got a golden goose on our hands. He, you it, think it, I, what? You he, think I'm just a PR guy? No, I think you are that guy again. I'm just I'm just one I, big no, I statement. Think, I think you are that guy. Behind pal. the camera, I'm with the cash and the prostitutes. Who bri who briefed you before this? Who gave you these talking points? Tobo. Tobo. Ah, uh, Tobo. Tobo. <laughs> Tobo said, "Tommy, Tommy, see, you, you, be, ge be genuine, <laughs> Tommy. I, see, I don't know. Like, you, you, don't you tell still, them about you, the money you lie. Please tell me about poggers, bro, because you you do this a lot. You like, I don't. You definitely have like a language. Like, I'm old now, poggers, you, and I don't know what you're saying. That's Twitch shit. Poggers is pog just means awesome, and it's just it just sounds funny. Uh, so I say it. Okay, pog I, jump in it. That's so easy to understand. I can. Oh, there you uh, go. Okay, give it a Google, Logan." Putting some effort. Mm. Break. You who do you watch on Twitch? Uh, Phil's of Minecraft. Mm -hmm. You watch Phil? Uh -uh. You watch Phil's? There? No. Change your life, Logan. I'll make you a better man. I'm. <laughs> I'm. What if you're already the best? You can't be the best. You're not the best, Logan. What about you? I'm not the best. I watch Phil's of Minecraft. Right. He humbles me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> you gotta watch Phil. I, I'm gonna watch ask Phil. Uh, okay. Thank you. I don't want any problems. <laughs> you're gonna watch. Fuck. You're gonna, you're watch, gonna Phil. watch Phil. Oh, bitch. He's got a wife, you know. Uh. Cool. Anyway, um, <laughs> uh, listen, Please listen, design. I'm going to ask you a question and, and, and for all the fucking Minecraft people, don't come at me. Oh, here we go. It's going to be about Twitter. Nah, bro. What the fuck is Minecraft? Like, what is that? What, you, what, what is, is the, I, hey, I, Logan, is this cap? Are you that guy? I'll tell you what I see <laughs> as a person so ignorant, right? Yeah. To, like video games in general. Yeah. But especially Minecraft, which I'm kind of embarrassed because it's such a big game and I should know. But I'm I'm with you, an expert. This is why I do the podcast. You know, I I love yeah. doing this podcast because I can also learn. And, and, and Minecraft, from my perspective, a noob, it is like a little like square person made out of building blocks going around to more building blocks Let's and building more things with blocks. Sure. <sighs> so, 
I for me, Minecraft is pretty good because it's a fucking like like canvas to make jokes on. So like you can do it and you can really like quite physically articulate like physical comedy in the game. So it's really good for making jokes on and video. Like I went on a Minecraft date and it's really clear what's happening, especially when you get mods in like proximity chat and stuff. Mm. But the game is, it's just a clear sandbox creative game. You know, you, you've played video games. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. I played, I played World of Warcraft. Yeah. It's just like a sandbox video game. Just give it a try. Isn't it? But are Fun. you, but is it like, uh, it's, it's not autonomous. It's up to each person to, create like like build a world build yep. a house like i saw i seen my friend that like had a lake once yeah that's i mean the lake's pretty fuck bro this guy's like yo this this, this fucking dude this doesn't know my crap is cap, noob. What are, cap boys i'm walk on what what what? <laughs> <laughs> what are wait what are what are speed runs uh it's where you, it's it's where you play the game but really fast as fast as possible it. yeah yeah are you good at speed runs I'm actually the uh, the two thousand three hundredth fastest speedrunner in the world. So uh, that's cap. No, nah, I don't cap. G. What? <laughs> Smoked him. Got My your man. ass, gangster. Got, got your me. ass. Eddie, every G. Time. It's over for you, homie. What? What's, Hog. what's the Hoggers. coolest? Thing, what's the coolest thing that you ever built in in Minecraft? God, you are just so old. Uh, yes. <laughs> you know, uh, you're so right. Yeah, <laughs> you're yeah. So right. He picked on you. No, uh, I, mean, dude, listen, I don't want any trouble. Pretty old too, Logan. Oh, 28? 28. Crack Why, why did I add two years? Like Crack a fucking age. Like I didn't even say a good You're age. You're going to have kids, Logan? I, mean, I said an awkward fucking because age. Neither, I'm only 26. Because we haven't slept in like eight days. Yeah. You're going to have kids, Logan? I'll have a couple. Why? Love myself. <laughs> and wants to make more of himself with the same DNA. <laughs> God, you suck. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> the worst. Uh, yeah, you? Kids? Oh, you, well, you are a kid. Never mind. Yeah, I'm too young. Too young. I ju I'm just making videos. You're just a guy making videos. So you are in a Bo Burnham song. How do you feel about that? You really kind of went on to Jimmy Kimmel about that. I really, you are in that funny feeling. You are part of the funny feeling, Logan. That's funny. Yeah. He's he's brilliant. He's brilliant. Yeah. You, yeah. Who who did who did you watch three four five years ago when you were growing up on YouTube? Uh, I watched a lot of Will Any. Um. Who? Will N.E. Will N.E.? Where he's mates with True Johnny. Oh, fuck. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just <laughs> fuck it. I don't, I don't so, know. Sorry I don't about know that, shit, bro. My, my consumption is not is where it should be. I don't um, watch a lot. Yeah, a lot of American TV with my parents. Like, every night we watch a sitcom before bed. So, The Office, Simpsons. No, no, no. I'm, take, I'm talking YouTubers. Uh, of course you are. Uh, Sunday, uh, he's a Minecraft YouTuber. Um, fucking... Steve will do it. I'm trying to think. <laughs> I'm shocked. Give him like a year watching. <laughs> no, no, no. Steve the, re the reason I ask is, is uh, I'm, I'm continuing this conversation. So I watched Bo Burnham religiously growing really? up. That was one of the like it was it was him. How did you feel being put in the song? Cool, awesome, really? uh, dude. I watched this guy growing up. I was I was uh, stunned with how creative he was. You know, a decade ago. And by the way, I just went back and like did the math on when he um, made all his songs back in the day. Um, like I, I'm Boyo, uh, uh, words, words, words. I think he was like 19 when he yeah. made when he made these Dude, music videos. Years, Dude, he's a genius though. Yeah, he's he's brilliant. He's and he's always and he's always been brilliant. And so yeah, being put in a song is incredible. I want to be like Bo Burnham. That is the thing you should be saying. I well yeah, I, that's how I yeah I do. He's, he's awesome, great. dude. Have Could you spoke you, to him? I, I I haven't. He's um he's a bit of a. I think he. I think he's a bit of a like recluse, a little bit introvert. introvert like yeah, yeah, a little bit. Yeah. He's he he's just he's probably a really 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 high functioning genius who who prefers like me a, alone. To, yes. You could be Bo Burnham. <laughs> I will be. Would you ever do like a Netflix type uh, long? Yeah. Long... Fuck yeah! Yeah, that sounds brilliant. Oh, dude, he's gonna. You're gonna be big, dude. You're gonna be massive. No, that's not God. This our podcast. We're kind of notorious for like predicting and like being ahead of, way ahead of just reality. Hey, Impolas, I'm gonna be big. Did you just did you just give a nickname to our audience? Impolas, yeah. yeah. Impolas, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I hate it. Yeah, he's re he is really big on the predictions. Had hit the little baby one right on the head. The day, the day that I retreated and retracted my little baby comments, motherfucker goes to jail. 
Like I was actually right. Should have just held. I should have a I little li- bit longer. Hours. Just a little bit. Hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, I was wrong about little baby. Little baby goes to jail. Gone. Hasn't had a hit song since. Not not true. He's featured on crying. featured on Drake's album. He's a beat. He's, he's he's killing crushing. it. You want to know something? The, sure. the, the the fun thing about your situation is. You can just cheat your way into victory on whatever format, platform, or vertical you do, you do. So if you want to become the bet world's biggest sh- chef tomorrow, and you want to start making souffle, do you know how to make a souffle? Yes. You can do that tomorrow, like this, and just be the world's biggest. Sh- if you want to be the world's best mini golfer tomorrow, what? you're the world's best. That's the interesting dynamic of being a hyper active like like really hot influencer you can just turn on in these new verticals and bring your audience with you to something new so if you did stand up or yeah, you started know, playing yeah. a guitar like you can just kind of win is that is that it's the phenomenon with boxing that but that's what i'm getting at though yeah a lot of my friends you know? started doing music and now they're like crazy big musicians right like, actually yeah dream song who would like makes the minecraft videos has like 60 million plays on spotify do you think that's fucked oh up my God. do you think that's fucked up like no what do you mean is it fucked up well because i mean at one point like to be a a, a renowned artist you had to be the best at the art Nowadays, you oh, just have to be or, the, or, the loudest or the best, at, like or the most mm-mm, talked mm-mm, about mm-mm, in it's, some it's, other. It's aspect. been democratized. It's it. You didn't have. Maybe you weren't the best. Maybe your record label's sick mm. back in the day. Now now it's you know anyone can do anything. He the, the thing about their stuff is they get the the initial like momentum boost, which is cool. That like that doesn't mean it's shit though. He he wouldn't be getting eighty million plays if it was bad, like at all. No, I I think it's totally fair. Yeah yeah. Good on him, man. It's it's brilliant. Yeah, it's fantastic. Like Tubbo will like Tubbo is be, my mate Tubbo. He, he released a song that was really good and he was like beating the gorillas in the charts like he's just because people can just do that and that's sick you know yeah like i think expressing yourself in whatever art is fucking cool it's like you know like if i went into stand-up comedy because i do comedy and do that like you wouldn't be like dude does that not fucking make sense yeah. like you know it's just what you do it, what you're asking is 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 the same critique that all the like again i'll just the relate box to boxing because we've seen For that sure it's it's you know these guys don't buy they haven't been here why is this fair why what you know it's we worked very hard over here, and I don't see a problem with parlaying my audience over here. But but also that conversation is is null on their side because you guys also you and your brother both work very hard on the boxing side. But I hear so. what you're asking though. I do. It's just a question. I mean, it's something to think about. Like it's it's you know are you there still do are there b- uh, not quit, so much. I'm quit. focused more on drinking right now. Yeah, he quit alcohol and not, not sleeping. Oh, and not sleeping. Like you, Logan. Again, it's just not safe, dude. I just want to be like you. The things I put my body through are... Um, are you all right? Like, no. No, I told you that at the beginning of the show. He's eight, By the way, he's aged like 15 years in the look past up, look like at, six months. Look at why don't directly you just, why? in Stop. between my eyes and tell me what you see. Go ahead. You can say it, bro. Tell right, me, I don't get it. Tell me what you see, bro. Right what here. What do you see over there? What do you see right here? It can't why? be that hard. Tommy, say it. I'm giving you permission, bro. Just fucking like, spots. What, yeah, yeah, that's, that's what fine. I've got them though. Don't no, worry no, about no, it, Logan. No, acne, fam. Yeah, I got that too, man. Don't, don't I'm a, worry about I'm a grown it. man, though, right? I'm so, a grown man. Okay, uh, so but eventually <laughs> the acne is <laughs> supposed to stop, bro. Like, it, you know, I'm more supposed to stop, and I don't have it often. But recently, I cream, I, my, my health Are you is your declining. Yeah, no, because I'm not sleeping. <laughs> We're showering like? ever. Oh, we haven't slept in eight days. I feel days. like you've got a, oh, eight, really? eight, eight, eight days. You gotta be healthy, man. It's like life's like a pyramid, right? And you can't do the top stuff if you don't so, have the bottom. So stuff. Rom- you gotta like so eat, sleep, fucking be healthy, have good mental health to do all the cool stuff, like start an NFT, do all, like you gotta work. You said on the eat, stuff. sleep, and fucking. You should have just stopped there. That's all he does. Yeah, but he doesn't sleep actually. You gotta sleep. Mm. sleep no, doctor. I don't. I'm not concerned with the acne, by the way. I wanted to tell you this. I think our our big issue that we're running into is these like the the lines on the my lab, face. Both of us, the the crow's feet. You worried about getting wrinkly at all? Nope. Ever. There's always gonna be beautiful. Yes. Fire. I just took a very serious tone. All of the, you're like, yeah, dude, I'm not okay. Hey, hey, dude, you want to get wrinkly? No, I'm jo- I, By the way, I'm being, I'm being <laughs> well, facetious. I was really I'm being concerned. Facetious. No, 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 no. Like, sorry. Oh, okay. I, I'm 100 percent okay. Um, oh, okay, uh, I got I, uh, <laughs> all of it. That took a really nah, serious, nah, serious tone. Uh huh. Bro, I'm a I'm a hundred and ten percent okay. I'm not sure I'm qualified, Logan. I, you know, I, I'm not okay because I'm just, like fucking not. But like that chaos is like currently where I'm thriving in this like 
like I'm in the I'm in the middle of like a, an art project myself. You know, you talk you talk about art, which I find fascinating. You know, it's a, it's a, it's not often that a kid uh, your age is is more focused on the art rather than literally everything that's what, else. I mean, that's what it, dude, if you want to get everything else, everyone looks at it the wrong way around. You got to make good fucking videos if you want to sell merch and make all that. Like, it doesn't matter. You, you can do whatever you want as long as it's, again, it's that fucking pyramid, right? It, and all the other stuff above it, selling merch, doing a YouTube, like whatever you're focused on, mm. doesn't matter if you don't have the good stuff, which is make good videos. And mm. that's art, man. Mm. That's fucking, you know. It's so, it's so cool to see uh, these, young, these young YouTubers on the come up. Because, you, you know, there's always going to be someone next next up and 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 it's you tommy in it thanks and by the way well. why why in it why are you are you in it where are uh, you oh yeah so everyone in nottingham would go like you're like in it after a sentence oh that's tommy. that's a that's british slang right yeah yeah and so and I, my name's tom simons but i was like tommy is the cool version of tom why is my name my name tommy it can be and so i just you know i just that was my username in it is that is that isn't it isn't it yeah like, uh, it's tommy isn't it? it's tommy isn't it? you're right in it in it like so no but it. in that context I, that doesn't make much sense to me well it doesn't but you know that's okay. you're all right <laughs> you're, you're all right in it like, like that you are right, in it what would you say in it like let's go get let's go get a, a sunday like, in that's it. some food in it like is that some food isn't it like question mark okay but. i think i'll go ahead and sure need that into my vocabulary sure, sure. you ever make a pizza or something <laughs> no Something to consider. You never made a pizza. Okay, you know I'll consider it. We can make pizza, Logan. I don't. I don't want to do it with you. No, you do. I don't. No, you do. Okay. Okay. I'm just saying. I'll, I'll what, be your pizza boy. What, what kind of pizza do you order? Like the meat feast or pepperoni. Really? Yeah, yeah. Do you have any hobbies? Like, like you like uh, assembling? Yeah, I uh, play the piano. I, I'm a I'm a grade five jazz pianist. I do a lot of piano and singing and stuff. And just you I sing? Did, I did sing lessons for like a year, but I don't. I I never want to do it like that. I just like. I don't. I don't think I'm very good at it. I just kind of like doing it. This is I can't wait for you to put out a song. Have you yet? No, I don't really. I do a diss track, or may, maybe if it was doing comedy things like Bo Burnham. But you're it's gonna. Not. You're gonna. It's gonna be sick. I don't really want it. It's you're not. going Everyone, to. I, it feels I, a bit oversaturated. I literally promise you that you're going to. Yeah, but you're I gonna realize. Would... You're gonna realize that if you can play piano and you can sing, you're gonna fuck it. Okay, my mindset on that is like I could be an okay magician, uh, not magician, musician. I, I, I knew it. I fucking God, told, fuck I told you. I, told, I, told, I, told, I, told, I called it earlier in the episode. I just said it. Dude. It's, 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 it's obvious. <laughs> That was no Tommy. No, Tommy you got it, you, that was a good joke. You pulled yourself yeah, out of the hat, yeah, brother. Like you really did, Tommy. Was, Get back in the hat. Just Get back in there. Continue what you were saying. I feel about like Jim Halper. I keep about looking at the camera. Ma like that. Magician. Uh, yeah, yeah. Like music. Like I could join the the all right musicians. Well, not all, right, but like there's a lot of musicians, right? Or I could try stand up, which is something that not many people. And I really want to try that. And I, like I might incorporate it into my stuff, but it's just not something I'm like. I'm really passionate and want to make videos and do all that. Uh, but I don't really like I'm just not it's not something that excites me and all that matters is like if you're not enjoying it or exciting it, it doesn't, like I just want to sit and play the piano that's kind of it you know interesting yeah you have taste dude even the way you thanks, dress Logan. like yeah no you're serious you got it going on dude where to go thanks Logan when are you gonna get a haircut my mum cut my hair the other day really yeah. you get along with your parents all is well and good in the yeah, family yeah they're brilliant a any siblings no got two dogs so oh, cool you fuck with them Oh, yes. I did not ask if you <laughs> fucked your dogs, Tommy. <laughs> That's right. What kind of dogs you got? He goes, what the fuck uh, did you A whippet say? and a Saluki Greyhound. Talking about whippets? Yep. I guarantee Tommy in it has no fucking idea what whippets are. And good, bro. By the way, not, good. And not, not the good. dog, Tommy. He needs to stay pure, the, bro. It, the world is a cold, dark place full of aerosol cool. going directly into your brain. You ever had a, ever be, you've never been to L.A., right? Nope. Don't don't go there. Don't go there. Okay. Stay here. You Tommy. guys are weird. It's not false. Mm -hmm. Stay here as long as you can, Tommy. Okay. You moving to Brighton though? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna move. I'm. I'm no. I'm. You know. I'm interested in doing hard crack. <laughs> I just really want to know what soft crack is. At this point. <laughs> I no soft crack isn't. It's gotta be me. hard crack. I'll move to LA and I'll crack by default is hard. That's what it's called. It's called hard. Soft crack is just cocaine. That's mush. Mush. I wouldn't do no mush. Mush ain't for me. The world's a dark place, dude. 
And I want you to stay. I want you to stay pure, Logan. I didn't know that until you told me. This is you've enlightened me, Logan. Tommy. Now I know the world it bad. No, Tommy, you don't know. And and your sarcasm. I'm not sarcastic. Logan. No, that was a sarcastic no, it joke. Wasn't. Tommy, listen to me. I, I don't do jokes. Tommy, see that I like was brothers. You ever read The Outsiders? Yeah. The book? Yes. <laughs> Pony Boy. The Pony Boy, 100%. Stay golden. 100%. Stay golden. Stay golden, Stay golden, stay golden Tommy. Tommy. All right. Pony I, will, I will stay golden for you, Logan and Michael. If you had to give me <laughs> one piece of advice right now, I'm nine years older than you, what would it be? Uh, you know... You know, when you're doing things, I think I think a very, it might not be an American trait, but thing I've noticed is a lot of people go like, right, I want to spend the next five years working really hard, and then I'm going to go be happy and live in LA. I think you should, uh, go, I'm, I'm going to get philosophical on you. Sure. I, I think, I don't know, my philosophy is like, it doesn't matter about what shit you're doing. You got to be happy, then successful. So no matter what you want to do, make sure you're happy first and don't, you know, go do that and then be successful and get all your videos. I also think you should make videos. I think you're very good at making videos. Like I was looking at your TikToks earlier and you're very, you're very creative with it and good at it. Like I know you're giving Bo Burnham a lot of credit, but you're good at it. You should go back to making videos. Like I enjoyed that. Thank you. I, I don't, I don't, I like just vlogs that you enjoy and you're passionate about because you're such a big name now that like, I, I think as long as you're into it and it, like it's a good content, like, I think you should make videos. Thank, thank you, Tommy. I appreciate that. It's all right. I'm I, just a genuine guy. You, you, you are sometimes. I am. You are. You sometimes. are. You know. You are. You really yeah. are. You really are. But you definitely. You definitely. Bro, jokes are more fun, right? Like I like. Just I comedy's like bouncing good, dude. between comedy and genuine because it. You know. It. It always. Always unsettles people, and that's amusing. I. I. I totally feel you. I. I had to. Um. Recently. Now, actually, more more than ever, um, I'm, I'm having less and less serious conversations because that kind of joking. Serious conversations are great, like off camera, but on ca I'm not here to be serious. That's Sometimes, recently, I, probably because I've been drunk, I don't want to have serious conversations. You're not like you're drunk, Logan. Paul. There's, the, I'm drunk more than I'm not drunk now. That sounds awesome. It is. It's playing with fire. Playing cool. With fire. I'm never drunk, other than when I am. Could you see yourself drinking one day after the crack? Uh, the hard I don't know. Crack. The hard crack. I think the idea of not being in control of your own brain isn't one that appeals to me. See, I'm the opposite. I, li I, like, ha I like that challenge. I like, okay. I like throwing my mind through a loop and seeing, seeing if I can survive so far so Yeah, great. I wouldn't. Yeah, I don't, it doesn't really appeal to me. So you'll never yeah. go to Burning Man? What, what, I don't know what that is. Okay. Imagine an uh, apocalyptic uh, environment where there is no money and every good <coughs> or service have you been i have twice do you get recognized a lot yes do you get recognized a lot in england yes how is it it's good do you take photos with everyone yeah everyone well 99.9% .9 of the time so if i'm rushing through the airport or some shit i'm going to miss my flight and it, or like it affects me i don't you take yeah. photos yeah, you, are time. you a nice creator, dude? Like you, do you give back to your fans? You know, Tommy, Tommy I love never recognizes me. I, I, I it's sort of like if it's if they just sort of know what I look like and are like, oh, cool. I, I'm usually a little bit faster and more like you know, because it, it it can be quite when you're just trying to be out with your mm. mates. It's like, yep. like I, I never say no unless like again, like I mean, I I can't. What about at dinner? What at dinner? Uh, I haven't had, maybe it's just a COVID thing. I haven't been out for many dinners. Really? You, if, when I'm at like Costa or something, I do, as long as it's not, I, I think I, I politely go, no, I, I'm very approachable, I found out. Like most of my friends don't have people coming up to them when they're on their own, but I do like always, which I'm sort of fine with because I, I think I've only had one person and it, even then it was very tame who was like, I don't like you. And I went, fair enough. In, in person? Yeah. Oh, that never oh, that's, happens. No, no, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, but I like, so if, if they sort of just know me and like like they they always go my sister right watches you and i'm like cool why would someone not like you uh, my humor is very subjective i think and i'm like th this is you know in my videos i'm a lot more i think my humor is quite intense and i think people go in and out of phases of my stuff like, i wonder if he meant he doesn't like you like he doesn't watch your stuff oh, the or side care for it all hate me because my whole bit is that i'm mean to the side men because because no one is ever mean to the sidemen, so but, they all just don't like it. But the but the sidemen viewers are, I'd imagine they're a little older than your demographic. Well, they're all like, they're sort of the same demographic, but not. I don't imagine the Tommy Unit viewers and the sidemen viewers would hang out at school. Okay, <laughs> so but, I mean they might. So, though, but I no, but no. I, this is what he was kind of asking earlier. You know, Describe a, t a Tommy interviewer and a sidemen viewer at school. Like, who are these? Like, what tables do they sit at? Uh, the sidemen viewers would play football. Okay. Uh, and the Tommy and it viewers would sit quietly 
thinking about playing Minecraft. Mm. And yeah, but I mean, I, I, that's just a, my very stereotype. Sure, but, sure. But what I was thinking about getting, re getting recognized is if like they see me and they know me, like I'll take a photo with them. I might be, I sometimes will go, I've got to be a bit quick if I'm in a rush to go somewhere. But when it's like someone clearly watches me, I've got all the, all the time in the world for okay. that. Because it's like being able to share such an impactful moment with someone so constantly, that's fucking awesome. It's very cool. So yeah, I'll take all the time in the world for that. Sure. Yeah, then by the way, like the, they'll remember these moments forever. Right, the, 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 I would do the, if I met me. Yeah, bro. Well, you're the goat and that I guy. Am the goat and the guy. Sometimes, Logan, you confuse me. I think you're confused. I am. I'm just a confused boy who wants to be more like Logan Paul. <laughs> Stop, dude. I can't Stop. get. I can't get it out of my mind that I'm gonna go to like Santa Monica in ten years and he's gonna just be pulling crack out of a hat, like a magic hat, dude. Dressed <laughs> as a magician. <laughs> With I'll a, be the just crack a magician. Pocket full of hard crack, dude. Yeah, don't just yeah. just stay clean, oh, dude. I will. Stay golden. Okay, I'll stay clean, but only because of you, Logan. I was on the verge of math, but I turned it down. Good. I think you just I turned thought, into a robot. What would Logan Paul do? <sighs> Good. <laughs> do you think your audience is going to have the attention span to watch yeah, this? Yeah, my audience. I think they'll enjoy this. They love you. They really. They like when I go on podcasts because I don't. I don't. Have hold you back. been on a podcast before? Yeah, I've been on Jack Mates, Mini Minters, oh, and nice. E Boys. Oh, awesome! And, and you say my first rodeo. Got it. Got yeah, it. Got yeah, it. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm experienced. I'm experienced. Got Could it. you see yourself <laughs> being a side man one day? No. I could see myself doing a group channel, definitely, but not not a side man, no. With Rambo. Rambo, Tubbo, Tobo, Wal Walba. Walbo. Drumbo. Not Drumbo. God, no, not Drumbo. <laughs> is that right? Is nah, that I'm just making things up. Uh, That's how I do it. You been to Stonehenge? <laughs> Have you been to Stonehenge? <laughs> no. <laughs> you haven't? How come no one from England has been to Stonehenge? Do you want to come with us? Nah. Yeah. Uh, Sorry. It's next to a pretty highway, much, I pretty, heard. Pretty much yeah, so I, How did the stones get there, though, Tommy? I, I don't know. So, so you don't know this? No, I don't spend much time uh, what, studying stones. I can. What do you know? I know a lot. But not where the stones came from? Not where the stones came from. <laughs> I yep. don't fuck with the stones, Logan. Give me three facts right now. <laughs> you, you're good at this. Yeah, I do this. That's one. Yeah, you, you're good at, yeah no, you're good at this. That's that's the same one. That's an opinion, Michael. Nah, that is a no, fucking a fact. Good Big it. No, it's an opinion. I'm good at this. Logan, are you arrogant? Yes. Then stop. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I, no. I if I was want, arrogant, I wouldn't stop. I don't want you to be arrogant, Logan. I'm joking. You need to be more grounded. I don't disagree. You need to go to a pub and you need to go, I'm Logan Paul, and watch all the old men look at you and go, fuck off. You need to go on the underground tube and go, hey guys, it's me, Logan. And everyone goes, I don't care. You need that in your life, Logan. This is Let the advice I was looking for earlier. Let me ground you, Logan. Thank you, Tommy. Please. Okay. Bro, I'm a, I'm a spoiled little bitch now, dude. Yes. It's a disaster. I think Jimmy Kimmel. He got in my head, yeah. dude. Fuck he you, Jimmy Kimmel. I'm not kidding. Really? I, that what, upset you? He said, he said, dude, he stabbed me in the back. What That's like say? my boy. He said Jimmy. Him. Jimmy. I'll give him a little message. Stop. Thank you. Sorry, what did he do? He said no. him and Donald Trump are best friends. No, so no, he said, he said, he said, he said some about, but it doesn't matter. We talk about it. You're a big Donald Trump fan, are you, Logan? No, I'm not. Good. What did he say? Once again, the sport of boxing has brought all the idiots out or something like that. What was it like? Who cares, dude? I don't oh, know. dude, who cares, man? All, all the American shit, torture. Dude. I really like John Oliver and I, I'm not, you know, I'm stereotyped. They're all fucking wrote to appeal to the most people. It's not, it's not art. It's not jokes. It's a team of a hundred writers, which is fine, but who gives a shit? It's Logan? all political it's, now. It, yeah, it's, it's fucking, yeah. they run it through focus groups. Who gives a shit, Logan? It's Congrats. Fine. They all that fucking matters played is, themselves, dude. 100%. Traditional media. You, uh, you believe in aliens, Tommy? Have you have you uh, uh, had time to to really cement? Why did you all look over there? Is I it? thought I saw one. Why is it so dark right now? You're in London, tinted, fam. Tinted glasses, isn't it? No, really though. Have you had time? See, to that's when I say in it like that. Tinted glasses. That made sense. Isn't it? Yeah. See, that's when you is say that it. in tinted glass in it. Tinted glasses, yep. isn't it? Mm. Like sort of reinforces your point. Cement your beliefs in the extraterrestrial. <laughs> have you had time to do that? No. No, I haven't even thought about it. No abstract or. I, I hope aliens are real. It'd be cool. Yeah. I'll vlog with an alien. I was going to ask you. You'd yeah. put one in? Yeah, yeah. I would. You'd collab with an alien? Yeah. Where do you think you're going to be in 100 years? Probably in a tube. In a tube? Can you describe that nope. further? No. Nope. Nope. Fair enough. Hey, what, um, about, what about in five years? Tube? 
Yeah, almost the tube. Not that, not yeah. there yet, but thinking about the tube. What do you think about Tesla bots, robots? And they go shopping for you. Oh, all them robots. It's fine, isn't it? It's just a bit like, where is this going then, everyone? To the grocery store. Why, why are we all making robots? Could you see yourself getting into a workout regimen and doing a body transformation for content? I'm what? So, I bet you can't do 10 push-ups right now. Nope. But I can make you cry. No, you can't. Yeah, I can. Because I'm a sociopath. No, I can make you cry. I'm just kidding. It's a joke. It's a, it's, I'm not. Well, I could make you cry, I cried Logan. yesterday, dude. I, and I'm a little good emotional man. right Crying's now. I could, I could probably cry right now. I can right make now. you cry, Logan. You probably could. Go. No, because it would, it would be too hurtful. How many push-ups can you do? I don't know. I, I walk to college. Get the bus. Tommy, how many push-ups do you think you could do? <sighs> I'm not going to start doing push-ups. I'm not asking. I'm just, you are asking. I'm not asking you, you, you to do to start doing I, I'd like to see you do one. Uh, well, I'm very light. Like, I'm very light. I don't have a lot of body weight. So I could probably do, like, 10. I reckon I could do 10. I might, that's on the, the high end, though. But then I'd be exhausted. And I, it's like, I bet you'll uh, dedicate a period of your life to working out. Yeah, yeah. It's really. I haven't done it yet, but it's especially when I moved to Brighton, I want to, like, I don't want to be fucking six-pack boxer man like you. I just want to be a bit like, I want to feel fit. Physical you, health and mental health are really important, right? You. That was great. One day, you are going to have a six-pack and muscles and the photo's going to go viral. For it. it doesn't matter. You're going to have it and the photo's going to go viral because people but, are going to be impressed with your transformation. I don't care you. for that, though. I think you're the next Bryce Hall. I think if you get the six pack, you can. Isn't he the one that KSI hates? Uh, I believe so. Yeah. That doesn't really narrow it down, does it? Mm, he KSI has definitely had some people he hates. How do you feel this podcast compares to the KSI podcast? Because he he you know I, I was been on the KSI, but what's the KSI? no no no? He was here. He was on this podcast in your seat. Oh, I was really? here. I was here. I'm Where meeting I... him in like two weeks. Oh cool. oh, you haven't met him yet? No, I've met him once for like five minutes, but we're doing a thing. Are you surprised with how uh, the height of the of, of YouTubers you meet? Because you're tall, dude. Did, you know, you're six foot two. Six foot three. You're six, six foot two, foot man. Three. Can you believe it? Even impresses Logan. And he's arrogant. <laughs> you love that word. Oh, I do. You love it. He stick, oh, I he, do. He, he got a couple you. words. He sticks with it. It's, you also put on your Instagram captions. That's why I say it. I was, looking, I was looking at your captions that I use. Well, I am a model and I am arrogant too, Logan. It's why I aspire to be like you. I need to be more arrogant. Logan, let's buy Lamborghinis. Gold, gold Lamborghini. I don't like Lambos. Yeah, you do. I don't like cars. What do you buy with all of your lots of money? NFTs and Pokemon cards. I'm not fucking kidding. What about big mansions? Uh, I like my money to make money. Okay. You you have a lot of money. So, don't let it sit around, so dude. Much money. No, I, I'm such a billionaire. But no one would know. And I may or may not have gambled it all away, but who knows? How much was that shirt? Uh, Wilbur bought this for me because he said you look really good in it and I went okay Will no I wouldn't and then he insisted he bought it for me and now I've worn it every day how much is it like 40 pounds I think I'm really not sure. I'm, I don't know it was ages ago uh -uh. I bet I bet that's a designer shirt I got it from Urban Outfitters and it has two oh okay okay, okay. Need a new one cool you messy when you brush your teeth is that it's what's happening? It looks like just it. Just spilling out? Well, I, I think I just might be. I know a girl who has to brush her teeth in the shower because it is so messy. Like, can you imagine? She literally what has to brush her teeth. What a dumb ass. What a dumb <laughs> ass. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> like, how is that possible? Control your saliva. I actually have overproductive saliva glands. Let me tell you. Is that, that's the thing? Let me tell you spit stories, Logan. Cool. I, when I was at the orthodontist, they were trying to do it in, in my mouth, but I just kept slobbering. So they were like... They didn't put the, the vacuum down your throat? No, they were like, we're not going to be able to do this. And one time in music, in year 11, I was talking, and it was 7 a.m., it was very early, and they asked me a question. Did, uh, oh, I can't say full name. She asked me a question, uh, the, did the teacher, and as I was talking, just a big bit of slobber came out, and everyone was looking at me, and I went, mm, fuck. Yeah, fuck. But, you know, I'm a slobberer, Logan. I, I, so I have to go every now and then because I just slobber a bit too much. But that's okay. <laughs> that's just who I am, Logan. That's great. It's better than the opposite. Do you slobber or not? If you think about nah, it. Nah, not much. I'll stop then if you don't. No, 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 it's good. No, it's... no, 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 no. I want to be more like you. I would, no, I wish I had um, uh, you wish you slobbered. more productive saliva glands. I really do. Why? Uh, something about being a dog ex excites me. And I feel like if I were able to, slob able to slobber like a dog, I that's cool. No. No, it's not. It's weird. I think you'll come to disagree when you're older. You ever had really dry mouth? The opposite? This has gotten weird.
It's been it's weird been the, whole time. the whole time. No, no, no. Just I made it cool, calm, and collected and normal. You two have just made it weird. I, Here's what you did. You came on the podcast. You challenged every guy in the room to a fight and said you, <laughs> and said, and said you did hard crack. But and that's just me, Logan. That's just who I am. Stop patronizing me. I, I'm not patronizing you. You just need to learn. Learn what? You just need to learn. Be I a know, better man. Be a better man. What happens if you already know everything? You remind me of a younger me. <laughs> I can't wait till he beats the shit out of you. <laughs> I'm so excited for that. You do, He's gonna Logan. Fuck you you up, remind dude. me of a younger me, and to that, I, I only feel pity. <laughs> <laughs> a younger you probably would have been a bit of a nightmare, no? Like, were you a smart ass when you were a kid? Not really. Just a, just a standout lad enough. your whole life? I'm just a standout guy. You know, I paddle through the angry tide, Logan. I, I sit on my little boat and I sit there as the waves bob, the waves of hate, and I go, not for me. Yeah. And then I come on your podcast. You're, you're a kid, dude. Look, you're 17, <laughs> you're 17 years old. Yeah. Are, you, are you a lad or are you a chap? Because we landed on chap. <sighs> I reckon I'm a bit of a chap. I don't, I don't think I suit the lad. I'm sorry, I just am. No, no, no gangs either. You don't. Uh, you're not banging. You're not claiming any. Couldn't sets. see yourself. You know, going under that that one tunnel here. What's the tunnel with all the graffiti on it, with all the gangs hang out? I didn't think you'd ask me. No, come on. A Is that a real thing? There's 100%. A hundred percent. We almost we, gangs hang out. We almost got slaughtered there. I'm not fucking kidding. Let me bro. ask you a question, fam. When he said in five also, years he's, he's going to find himself in a tube. What do you think he meant by oh. that? Yeah, no, he's in he's claiming a set already, oh, bro. Oh fire. Okay. That's what I meant. He's he rap he's rapping a set, dude, hundred percent. Cool. You ever shanked somebody? What's your favorite food? Uh noodles, yo sushi, wangamama. I like that. You ever had wangamama logo? You asked me to get Nando's after the podcast. Do you wanna get Nando's with me? Perry Perry chicken? I kind of do, dude. Okay. Do, dude. We can get Nando's. Cool. Do you have time? Yeah. We'll yeah. get Nando's then. Dude, you know what's so crazy? You know what's so crazy? I remember when I remember when Jacob Satorius was on. Mm -hmm. And not to compare you to Jacob Satorius, but I'm gonna. Don't, and I remember no, thinking. Don't, Logan. Don't. I'm going to, <sighs> in a good way. Okay. I remember thinking this was a mistake having this kid on the podcast. <laughs> Because because I realize he's so young, he doesn't have like anything. That, there's no substance, you know. There's, and it's not his fault. He just hasn't lived enough life. And yet, this kid, you're full of life and and knowledge for some reason. Like, how do you know? How do you know things, dude? Like, how do you know things? Dude, I just since I've had like. I think when I had like 2,000 subscribers, my rule was just like, it's the internet. Who gives a shit if someone ignores you? So whenever someone followed me, I just messaged them going, hi, can you call? Like, I just message you. Hi, can I come on your podcast? And you're like, all right. Yeah. I, I just do that because it's like, worst case, they ignore you. You're not it's afraid fine. of rejection. No, because it's Girl fine. leaves you on scene in the DMs. How you feeling? I block her. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that bitch. I yeah. don't call her a bitch though. I go, excuse me, madam. You yeah, fucked I feel up. You. And then I block her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excuse me, madam. You fucked up. You fucked up. <laughs> that's yeah, that's hard. That. But you know, I just, I just have always just asked everyone. Like, uh, I just think oh, I'm going off. I'm going off philosophical on you, Logan. Go. Um. Yeah, I just think everyone around you all the time knows so much more than you. And if you just ask people, they tell you. And so many people just don't ask people about things because, like, it feels a bit weird or a bit rude. But then you just acknowledge it, and then just like, I find the more self-aware you are about things, it's like easier. And I think, like, yeah. yeah. That's a very good point. Yeah, bro. I you surround know, yourself you know, with you, people that are smarter than you. You know, I think like I, everyone's uh, a moron, but the more you accept that everyone's a fucking moron, the closer you can start. You just got to work on not being one. You know, like my biggest goal is just not being a dick because I like that's my biggest fear over anything. Look at me, Logan. I'm so genuine. That's Did good. my PR team brief me on this? <laughs> I don't. Do you have a PR team? <laughs> got me mum. She sometimes, if I'm apologising <laughs> for something, I go mum. What do you think of this? She goes, no, emphasize it more. And I go, all right. Wow. You know, I think I have what a theory. Think? I have a theory. I think Gen Z, you, kids born. Tobo. Tobo. Kids born early 2000s, uh, even, 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 you know, maybe, maybe even like late 2000s. Uh, I think they're getting smarter, wiser, and uh, more self-aware much much sooner because of the internet i don't i think it's just me i don't think so no. i think your generation's a special one i really do believe that your generation's going to change the world like like oh, i am 
I'm the next. Nah, Mr. I didn't Beast. say you, man. I'm the next Mr. Beast. You're the next. I'm Beauty the next Pie Mr. meets Bo Burnham. Yeah. Meets Tommy meets in Mr. it. Mr. Beast. Meets Mr. Beast. I want to be the next Mr. Beast. He, yeah, that's cool. That's aspirational and and, I know, and good. Really. But I I I really I, I really do think you're you're. Do ju- I confuse you? I don't I don't really have a brain. Hmm, elaborate. I don't have a brain. That's it. Okay. Oh, okay. I no, I get you. That's pretty uh, based. Yeah, you confuse me, man. <laughs> this this is fast. This is fast. This is a fascinating dynamic. It started off so strong, and now I'm just I, I don't know who I am anymore. I can confuse you, Logan. Yeah. I'm you ever get your IQ tested? You should do that. No, I'm not. It doesn't really bother me. I think I did it once on a stream, and I had a pretty low IQ, and I went, oh, right. No way. Yeah, way. No way. I can't do maths, Logan. I'm bad at maths. Are you getting good grades in school? Well, I do film and TV in my college, so I'm not like it's like a, just a class for that. But in school, I did like a year and a half ago. I was really bad at maths and science, and then English language was the one. I got like an A star star, which mm. again, that was my big one I could do is English. I, I just I really like English and talking, so... Uh, it's creative, isn't it? So it's, it's it's the best. I was just talking with someone about this the other day. The one class that I, I loved in high school, AP language. It's it's it taught me everything I know about just uh, communication and like syntax, grammar. Language language is number one, dude. Language is is absolutely number one, paramount to anything that you do in real life. So yeah, and I can tell with you, you ha- you do have that like. So it's one of the first things I said. I was like, you're articulate. Thank you. you. You know words like you, uh, you arrogant. That's a pretty big word for you. I feel. Oh, you are. I'm. I am what? Arrogant. Arrogant. <laughs> no, no, you are. No, I'm not. You captioned it on your Instagram. No, for no, you love no. It. Logan, I'm based and grounded, and I'm not self-aware about it, and that's what makes it even better. Do you feel like you can be arrogant? <laughs> <laughs> like, like I often wonder this with like com- comedians: Are they really actually arrogant, but they hide behind the veil of comedy? What do you mean? Yeah. No, you're like, you know, you make a joke. You're like, oh, it's a joke. Well, like Bo Burnham's song, Art is Dead, is pretty, like, he's basically like, like the equivalent of Art is Dead is imagine if you went, you posted a YouTube video going, I've got a po. This is what my, my mate Wilbur's hot take is. I, okay. I haven't watched it many a time. He basically said, sorry, Will and Bo Burnham, if you see this. But he basically went, imagine if you went, have you heard the song Art is Dead? Oh, uh, yes. Like, imagine if you went live and had a poem and went, here it is. <sighs> my job is so easy and I make so much more money than all of you and it sucks and it's not fair, but I do. Uh, and it doesn't make any sense, but I make so much more money and I'm so famous and it's hard, but it's le- much less hard than what you have to go through. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This, ha- this song helps me sleep at night. You go, what a fucking arsehole. But he does it in a song that makes it. And I, I haven't watched Art is Dead that many times, so I, I haven't sat and fucking worked out. But that's Will's point of view on it. And everyone on Twitter disagrees because they're like, oh, you missed the point of the song. But it's like, yeah, I, I think comedy makes it a lot more easy to be arrogant because you can't tell when someone's being sarcastic or not. But I, you know, I try and like, th- there's obvious, there's clear moments in this podcast. Someone could timestamp when I'm clearly being genuine or just saying shit. You know, yeah, it's quite easy to avoid shit if you just fucking keep swapping between. It also confuses you. Yeah, great. Which you're doing a great job. Yeah, at. thank you, thank you, thank you. You could. Pro- was already comfy. He didn't get me before. I- I, a lot of people probably don't. You. Ha- it's yeah, great. I'm not kidding. You. You. You sort of have the to. Comments do. Yeah, well, you, and your audience does, and like the people who are watching this podcast. Like the Simon viewers don't get me; they just think I'm just an arsehole because I because I keep t- telling KSI you're, I could beat him up. Yeah, that's, bro, that's funny. You're very sarcastic. You're very dry, bro. You told me you were gonna fucking sit on me, dude. <laughs> it, it, we I? tweeted back. At, yeah, bro. You said you and your boy are gonna use me as a park me bench. Me and Ram. Yeah, we will. <laughs> anyway, sorry. Go on. <laughs> I want to see that. Nah, I think we're done, dude. Wait, what? You want to end? I'm having a brilliant time. You you are brilliant. That's why. You, you go ahead. Me. You do find me. Other people have called brilliant. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> You're on the list with Tana Mojo. Let's put it like that. You and Tana Mojo are like this. From TanaCon. Uh, yeah, from TanaCon. I want to be on the brilliant list. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. How's uh, yeah, Jake doing these days? He's. Are you? Do you like him? I don't know him. Do people call you Jake Paul ever? Nope. Must be nice. Yeah, he's good cool yeah well guys thanks for watching impulsive <laughs> the number one podcast thanks in the world for watching yeah we're doing a video uh for your channel your vlog yeah, channel Tom si- um, shall i shout out my channel yes uh good so guys you can hit the subscribe button on this channel subscribe guys only a small percentage of what i can do my subscribe voice if you want sure really yeah please
Guys, guys, most people find this podcast annoying at first and for a lots of time. So please do subscribe. It's completely free. You can always unsubscribe later. Uh, only a small percentage of the viewers are subscribed. So please just double check. It's completely free and it takes two seconds of your time. My turn. Thank you guys okay. for listening, yeah, watching, yeah, viewing, I, and subscribe. No, it was good. That was fantastic. Was it good? Was it good? Yeah, bro. I can you can cut that if you want. You no, we're I, 100% you know, cutting I felt it. arrogant there, Logan. I was arrogant. It was good. I was arrogant. It takes two seconds of your time. <laughs> I liked it. No, it was great. It's it fantastic. Was arrogant. It was arrogant. It was not arrogant. It was arrogant. <laughs> I'm just an arrogant guy who hides behind comedy. Well, we have yet to find out if that's true. Oh, no. I am so arrogant, Logan. Let's go to Nando's and talk about objectifying things. Sounds like a horrible idea. Fantastic. Mm. All right, guys. That's it. We love, we love Tommy. And thank you for coming on. Thanks Paul for having me on, man. Of course. No, of course. Yeah. We'll see you next time. Jordy, thank you for letting us bum your set again. Oh, thanks, and Jordy. He's, he's somewhere up did you flip me off? Oh, that was a thumbs up. Thumbs up. <laughs> yeah, I thought you went. All right, we're done. Bye. <laughs>